Hey, good morning. This is Ken. Uh, this is the second video in a short series of videos on basic boiler maintenance. Uh, these are um, tips and suggestions I've learned through technicians and friends and researching on the internet in lieu of hiring boiler guys to come out and maintain my boiler every year or and it just gets expensive and uh, I'm on a, a little bit of a, of a budget. So uh, I do what I can to keep it going. If something does go wrong, of course I'll call the professionals to come over and uh, do the job for me. But basically, uh, this is what you do to keep your boiler uh, up to date. So, um, for example, last night I had the boiler on and it was keeping the house warm. And uh, this morning, the water is uh, a little bit warm in the boiler. It's not boiling. So it's a good time to drain the water from the boiler. The water that's uh, went through the pipes and uh, got a lot of rust in it and what could potentially clog this low water cut out. So this handle controls the valve to the low water cut out. So I'm going to go ahead and put this valve in the up position, opening the valve and the water, which should be dirty, is going to come out here. So. I'm going up here. I'm going to go ahead and take this guy and put it in the up position here in a second. But I want you to see the dirty water coming out of here because uh, the, the previous video you couldn't see it. So here you go. There it is. Man, there's not much. <laughs> I guess that's good. So the valve is closed. Um, a couple things I learned from uh, since the last video I had is the water level in the uh, boiler. I think previously I said it should be in the uh, it should be below half. Well, um, my buddy said it needed to be above the half. So I've been I've been all this winter I've been doing it here, and it's been uh, a lot better. It's not gonna um, over I guess over stress or overheat your components of your boiler if the water were to get low. But previously I think I had it down to here, which uh, he said was way too low. So I've been doing it about this level here. So here's about half. It's just a little, little above half. And um, the next video I'm going to do is actually right now. I'm going to do it in a second. Is uh, how to change the sight glass. So uh, hope this helps you guys a little bit. And uh, here we go for round number three. Thanks.